guys, this is what I started doing today. This is video four on this paneling. Um, you can see here, uh, I got them all roughly lined up pretty pretty good. I started over here and uh, kept pulling the trigger, you know, and splop, spot welding it all the way around. Uh, all the way around over here. Actually, that's not what I did. What I did was I tacked each corner first, and then I went to the middle, middle, middle. Then I just kind of started tacking here, and then would come over here and just just alternated it. After I would well, after I do a, a certain area about an inch or so long, I'd take some water and I would pour it on it so that way it wouldn't keep heating up the steel because that's what causes the holes to blow through it when the steel gets too dang hot. I would do like an inch and then go over to then pour water on it, get it cooled off, then go over to another spot, do about another inch, and alter jump all over the thing. And so that way I wouldn't get any warping or anything like this on the piece or anything like that. So I've got from this corner here welded up around to this point. And then over here I have just this one corner tacked and this lip here, let me switch this over to, let me switch the camera here. Okay, there we go. Now you can kind of see this lip right here. What I'm going to do with that is that's just dumb to try filling that in with weld. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my grinder and I'm going to grind that. Uh, I'm going to grind that lip. Uh, so that way it matches this panel here and then I'm going to start welding. there but uh, yeah we're gonna whip out the grinder we're gonna see how well I did on this 
<laughs> yeah. All right. Well, let's see. That's where we're at. That's where I'm at so far here. Just got done grinding everything off. Now I'm going to uh, take my sandpaper to it. See how well I can dress this thing up a little bit. Still got a little bunch of little pits here and there. The welder didn't really work too well, but let's see. Well, all right. Got her welded up. Still a little pity, but that's good enough. Yeah. Some of the seams are, you know, this turned out pretty straight. Uh, that's a little wavy right there. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to prop the cart up and use my Sharpie and mark the insides where the bars of the frame come in contact. Because this might have shifted and messed around on me. So I'm going to do that so I know where uh, the frame is at underneath there. Well, I tried to get under there with my pen, but there's just too much stuff in the way. So, I'm going to have to oh, Not going to show you guys that. All right. Well, cleaned it all up, and I whipped out the black spray paint and painted her up. And that's what she looks like. I wanted, I wanted to uh, pour 15 this whole thing, but I don't have the money to do that. So, just going to have to spray paint the whole thing. So, yeah, what I'm going to be doing is uh, the outside of this shield is going to be. Uh, spray painted black the inside is going to be spray painted white because I plan on putting some LEDs on the inside of this to create some glow to the inside so I don't know how well that's going to work though. I'll probably get over spray from the white on this thing if I do that dang it well we'll see what happens